Hey, what's up, everybody? Whatever, all that other stuff. I don't. It, okay, this is a special episode. I'm talking UFC 246. Camera, why are you not in focus here? Let's go, camera. Let's go, Cannon. Okay, UFC 246. Conor McGregor. Like, subscribe, tell me all that stuff. I'm, this is a special episode, and this is fight week, right? Conor McGregor versus Donna Cerrone for all the marbles, for all the you know uh, hoo hoo points, right? All that good stuff like that, right? Conor McGregor. The only now I figured it out. The reason why he came out to fight again is because. There's a way that you have to coax this guy. This guy is a money machine. This guy is going to be so beneficial to the UFC, to ESPN, right? How do you coax this guy out? Is you give him a shoe deal. You give him, you partner with Reebok, and Reebok says, we're going to have a new shoe come out. We want you to be the ambassador to it. We want you to, we want to use, can you post a, we're going to make a special video, a claymation video, stop animation video of you, and we're going to make it, and can, and can you put it on your 33 million subscriber base on Instagram? Can you do that for us? Those 33 million people on Instagram are your target audience, are, are the people that Reebok wants to sell these shoes to. So what do they do? They probably give them a fat deal, a fat fat deal to try to get him to come out and play right that's the ammunition that a person like conor mcgregor needs that's what he needs dude he needs the big boy deals dude he needs the big boy deals the big boy deal is look we're gonna play you a, bo a boatload of money you're gonna get pay-per-view points we're gonna pay you this pay you this pay you that and we're gonna give you a shoe deal and we're gonna make commercials out of you and we're gonna help you grow your brand and we're gonna advertise you on the reebok fan base and that fan base and we're going to grow everything right we're all going to take advantage of the situation now that's how you coax a superstar out right where did you get this from right they say to yourself well ruben how does this happen the ufc has had a hard time getting conor mcgregor to fight this has got disney strategy written all over it right this has got the experts that are disney that are disney that are disney that know how to do everything right they know how to get people to come out and play. They know how to buy Star Wars and make more money out of Star Wars. Baby Yoda. That's all I got to say. Okay? They know how to get the Baby Yoda out. And Baby Yoda, when I say Baby Yoda, yes, I'm going to connect the dots. The Baby Yoda is Conor McGregor in this situation. Right? That's how you do it. It's so ingenious. It's so smart. Kudos to Dana White, the UFC, to listening to Disney and their expert level strategy. Okay? These guys at Disney, they got to figure it out. It doesn't seem, I don't know if this has happened before in mixed martial arts where you have a star coming out. George St. Pierre never did this, okay? George St. Pierre never did something like this. Nobody in the history, that's the only person I could think of that's just as popular as a Conor McGregor, who maybe was just as popular. you never seen Tito Ortiz, Chuck Liddell, any of those characters or people or fighters or whatever, entertainers, I, no disrespect, but you never see any of them do this kind of stuff. They launched a shoe and Conor McGregor came out of this retirement because he has so much money already and it's good for his brand as an ambassador. That's why he's the good guy in these videos. That's why he's changed the narrative, right? There could, could there be two good guys? No, the narrative is he's coming back and he wants, and he, uh, this is, he's on his redemption tour, right? A la John Jones, but he's doing it way better with the backing of Reebok, right? All you UFC fighters should be taking notes. You should be taking notes. And this is how you become a super mega star. This is how you become like the rock. Remember the rock sold out his shoe for Under Armour is the number one selling, you know, his clothing line for, for Under Armour is number one. And he's not even uh, an official athlete, right? He's not connected to a sport, right? Although he does a show ballers, but we're not gonna get back into that. Anyways, long story short, this video is going too long. Conor McGregor did a number and he's showing everybody how you can capitalize on your fame as an entertainer in the mixed martial arts game. Everybody take notes, right? Everybody take notes. And who is gonna be the next person now Donald Cerrone has capitalized this a little bit because what does his Instagram have? Budweiser, which is amazing. So Donald Cerrone is on that level, not quite, but Donald Cerrone is taking a note out of the Conor McGregor uh, uh, rule book of life on how to do this. So it's, I thought it was a very interesting video. I'm not gonna, I don't usually do this many videos, but I gotta put this one out. I thought it was very key and interesting when I saw this. I was really impressed with this idea that Conor McGregor is picking back what he's doing and Reebok wants a piece of the action. Talk to you guys later. Subscribe. Tell me what you guys think. Bye.